I'm Brian Abel. Here are your headlines from 7 Action News. The Bangladeshi community demanding justice for a cab driver who was gunned down while he was driving. Joynal Islam shot and killed early Saturday morning on Detroit's west side. He then crashed his vehicle into a tree in the 600 block of Collingwood. It's not clear what led to the shooting and so far no arrests have been made. Detroit police want to identify this man described as a person of interest in a deadly triple shooting. The victims were gunned down early Saturday morning in the 3400 block of Devonshire on the city's east side. Two of them pronounced dead at the scene. The third passed away at the hospital. A woman posing as a fake Kroger employee wanted for making the rounds and targeting senior citizens. Cynthia Littleton has been caught on camera at multiple apartment buildings in Highland Park. Police say she cons people into subscribing to a phony mobile pantry. Littleton asks for cash up front and claims you'll get free groceries in return. Once she gets through the front door, she steals people's belongings. Littleton also goes by the names Cynthia Finley and Karen. Well, rain went away for a nice day, but it is coming back. Mike Taylor, timing it out for us, Mike. Finally, we get some dry time for tonight. 63 degrees. Clouds are going to be increasing a little bit. And then once we get into your Sunday, we had a high of 77. We'll turn mostly cloudy and there will be some rain chances around mainly in the afternoon. The worst of it seems to stay south of Detroit, but keep the umbrella handy throughout the day. Once we get towards Memorial Day, we had a high of 73. We'll start off dry with some sunshine, but later in the day, here comes the showers and also the storms. We're going to be in for a cold shock if you decide to take a plunge in one of the Great Lakes. The water temperatures currently range from 30 to 50 degrees. Now these readings are a little colder than normal for this time of year and experts warn it's dangerous to swim when the water is that cold. Well, those are your headlines. Remember, you can always go to WXYZ and our app for news anytime. I'm Brian Abel. Have a great day.